Stiff Neck Studio has got the meats. Spiking bits. Welcome back, Hobby Maniacs. I'm Rob Bear from SpikyBits.com. And we have a wonderful painted miniatures showcase for you today from Stiff Neck Studios. I have known the owner of Stiff Neck Studios for quite a few years, to be quite honest, and we've never collaborated on anything. And finally, after years of talking about it, we actually did it. <laughs> so here we are. It's a brave new world. We're going to take you over to their website, which will probably change by the time this video actually comes out, but that's okay. Uh, through the magic of the internet, it's all going to probably look the same and pictures, well, they don't change. So let's jump over there real quick, show you their website and how you can get a hold of them and actually take a look at a gorgeous painted miniature by them. So here it is, stiffneckstudio.com. Let's jump back up to their homepage right here and you can see for yourself, there's a lot going on here. They have home services, gallery, gallery is not working right now. Like I said, they got a new website coming, but they have this flashy little animation showing some of their painted products right here. And then some of the links to different things, Facebook, eBay, all the socials, things that they're going to this year. We saw them at Adepticon, we saw them at Vegas. Uh, I guess they're going to War Games Con as well. Now, the thing I like, about Stiff Neck Studio is, well, it's run by an active duty US uh, serviceman, US military serviceman. And what's cool about it is the, the attention to detail is definitely there. Now, the one thing I, that probably sets them apart from just about every other studio out there is they only paint to one level. And, and, and here's why. You're, always probably gonna get the same quality from them. And as he explained it to me, you know, they throw in free resin basing, uh, a lot of different touches that you're not gonna find at these other places. And you're not gonna see, oh, hey, my army was painted by Stiff Neck. And then at a tournament, you go down 10 tables and a completely different army was painted by the same studio. It's all gonna look the same and you're probably gonna be able to pick it out. They can assemble stuff for you. They actually probably prefer it because of their techniques. You'd have to work with them on all that. But the thing I like right here is, uh, their wording on pricing and payment and this is what's this is what a, is a big thing to me they're not gonna sugarcoat it you know they're like hey we only have one price we we do our best but in some ways we can work with you on price whether you want to spread it out or something like that i don't exactly know uh, i don't even know their pricing i didn't ask them they provided this model for us to check out i don't even know their pricing but i can tell you that it probably isn't cheap and that's just you know valuing artists for their time. Minimum wage means minimum skills, but when it comes to uh, hands-on classic, you know, trained artists that do this for a living and have awards and, you know, are basically journeymen at some point of doing this, you're going to have to pay for that expertise. And I know a lot of people don't want to hear that, and that's just a hard truth. <laughs> uh, they will work with you, like like they say in here. Uh, if it's not in your budget, they can tell you per perhaps where they can meet you, maybe paint a few things for you, or refer you to some other studios that they know will do a good job within your budget. So that's what I really like about it. They want to make sure you're getting taken care of, like I said, active duty, military, attention to detail, one, one level, one paint level, you're going to be able to pick their stuff out from a mile away when it comes to that. So lots of cool benefits when it comes to working with these guys. Turnaround, I think, is about two months, give or take, on a whole army. Of course, they probably have different timetables on different things and different projects, but they can do conversions. They can do all sorts of things, and there is a discount for ordering your models through them. So contact them. Sometimes they can't say it out, you know, for different companies, but definitely work with them. Uh, they'll get a quote for you and tell you about all of that price. And that's a, just a gorgeous Necron conversion right there. Now, here's another thing that's very important to me. When you see a picture on someone's website of, oh, man, it's a gorgeous painted miniature. And you always kind of wonder, like, did they mess with the photography? Did they mess with anything? I can tell you right now, this Morkinot or possibly Gorkinot. Now, I'm just kidding. I'm pretty sure it's a Morkinot. Uh, was taken with a traditional camera. And you can tell that because, you know, it's focused on the front of the model where you see in the background. It's a little bit more fuzzy. That's, you know, traditional camera type technique. You don't really see that on cell phones and things anymore uh, because they have multiple cameras inside the phone that focus at different depths. Now, check this out. 
here is the same exact model they provided for us. This is a gorgeous miniature. It looks a little bit lighter than in the picture, and that's because, well, I have a lot of lighting here directly on it, literally inches away from it. I'm sure if we, you know, tinkered with different things, like I pulled the light back right there, it looks very similar. So that's, you know, very, very remarkable. And like I said, the attention to detail is very great coming from Stiff Neck. And here he is in all his orky glory, Mr. Morkanaut. This is an amazing miniature piece of art. This is their one level, their one paint job style. You're going to see it. They got custom um, stencil work, or this is actually a custom detail decal. You can barely see it in the video right here, but trust me, that is a decal. They've got a little bit of fading and some airbrush stencil work and some great, great, great glowy effects. Yes. That is that atomic green. It is there. It is that bright and vibrant. It's gorgeous. Custom resin base with, uh, let's see if we can get some light on this matter, with a little bit of water effects underneath it. I mean, just the amount of detail here. Parts still move, like the arm actually still moves. The little rockets rotate and can come off the back. I mean, there's just so much work in depth in here. All the horns are hit the you know all of the highlights the os the faux osl all the wiring all of this in here very 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 well done imagine an army painted to the standard they've got great communication because from you know a military background you could definitely expect that coming from a military officer and they got tufts you gotta have tufts why not have tufts so free resin basing like i said with all their stuff it's gonna make your stuff look great it's gonna give it a little heft a little bit of girth to the actual model to help you kind of carry it around. It's gonna look gonna look great. It's got some chipping in there and all sorts of different things. So I can't say enough good things about the work ethic and attitude of these folks here. They've got a bunch of artists ready to go for your project. Like I said, whole army turnaround's about two months-ish, give or take. I haven't had a whole army done by them yet, but maybe we'll get them to work on some of our personal stuff here in the future. I mean, there's always there's always something to go around here in the studio, but I mean, just a gorgeous miniature and, you know, hit them up, give them your vision, see what they think. If not, like I said, they'll they'll refer you to somebody that perhaps can work more in your budget or they can do a little bit more for you. I don't exactly know. So remember, great communication, turnaround times, uh, additional discounts for getting your miniatures through them. All of these things, hit them up, Stiff Neck Studio at gmail.com or stiffneckstudio.com for the full, hopefully new website experience. So that's it for this one on our latest Army Showcase featuring, well, it's not quite an Army Showcase, but <laughs> featuring the Morkinot or perhaps Scorkinot. It's really hard to say <laughs> at this point. Thank you for watching this video and make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you can be the very first to like and comment on all our videos.